This is your best mix of music, 98.4 Capital FM, Miss Mandy. And I'm loving the fact that the past of, um, uh, Fridays, I've been having amazing artists in studio with me. And today we have a really big artist in studio with me. Hey. How you doing? How you doing, sir? I'm very well, thank you. How are you? I'm good. I have so many questions for you. First of all, welcome to Nairobi. I'm pretty sure you've heard that for like the past couple of days. Yeah, so, hey. it's an um, amazing place. I have to say that I really, really love people who blow up off the internet because uh -huh. I think like digital is everything. Yeah. And um, a lot of people know you for your records, Man's Not Hot. Uh -huh. But yo, I admire the fact that you have a YouTube show that's really huge. Uh -huh, thank you. So are you feeling like you're going to ever transition to like Netflix or um, uh, let's say, you know, Hulu, Amazon, you know, they're buying a lot of shows. Yeah. So do you feel like that's the direction you're going to go or you're just going to focus on music? No, I think for me, like, uh, I enjoy being a, a multifaceted entertainer. Mm -hmm. So I never would ever say, oh, I'm just going to focus on just one thing. Okay. You know, I, I, I'm very appreciative for the fact that I'm blessed to do, you know, different things. So, um, But in terms of, like, uh, transitioning into Netflix and TV and all of that, definitely everything will have its time. Do you uh -huh. get me? But, uh -huh. like, um, for, for right now, for uh, the show that's on YouTube, hashtag Swill, mm -hmm. that would stay on that platform for now. But obviously, I'm we're working on a bunch of other stuff as well. Do you get me? Okay. So, you know. Speaking of working on a bunch of stuff, I'm curious. Like, uh -huh. give us a little snippet. What's the other couple of things that you're working on? Uh, Come you on. know, I, I'm, I'm someone that likes to show. I don't really like to talk too much. It's like Beyonce. You know how Beyonce just brings the work? Yeah. She never tells us what her next no, move is. Yeah, I just like to show. Okay. I don't really like to uh, talk too much. Just kind of just, yeah, just land it. Um, any other destinations in Africa you guys have hit up before here? Uh, the only one place we've been to before was Nigeria. Okay. Uh, we had a show out there with uh, Migos. Ooh, and, and that Captain was nice. Conan. Yeah, that was that was definitely like a first introduction to Africa, and, yeah. and it's been nothing but love ever since. Still, okay. like, and this has just been a, uh, like a, a next step. So I'll be honest, like since we've been here. When you were in Nigeria, was that how the collaboration with Tiwa and uh, Mr. Easy came about, or? No, um, basically. Mr. Easy at the time had a tune out in London, uh -huh. uh, the skin tight tune, yeah. and it was mashing up the clubs, and um, that's where I first heard it, and over time I just reached out to him and I was like, yo, I love this tune, mm -hmm. then um, we kind of built a connection from then, and he, when he was sorting out the remix, he reached out to me and Steph Dam, mm -hmm. and um, we just done the remix, and then we've always been in contact since that, so when we created a love struck, mm -hmm. when I heard the tunes at the beginning, I always had him in my mind to, to go on the song, so mm -hmm. I reached out to him, and I literally sent him over the song, and he done it straight away, and it was the rest of his history, really. Okay, and then Tiwa? Tiwa, um, literally, so at the time, it was just me and Louie, um, Mr. Easy on the song, mm -hmm. and then um, we were thinking it needs one more verse, and we were just listening and thinking who else can we get on it, and we thought let's have a female, and I'm a big fan of Tiwa to begin with anyway, and um, we kind of made that decision and reached out to her, and she came to London and played the song, and then she gave that verse. Shortly after that, we shot the video, and yeah, we're just kicking off. Okay, that's pretty dope. Are you guys looking to collab with any other African artists? You know, especially now that you're in Kenya, are there are any Kenyan artists that you've been like probably listening to. Yeah, or do you know what's, what's funny is um like the first day we got here, we had like a conference, mm -hmm. and we got asked that same question, mm -hmm. and I, like we haven't slept at all. Ooh, so, okay. Like, I was like, I was like, I haven't even slept. I, I mm -hmm. haven't even had a chance to take anything in, but I want it. Mm -hmm. And um, just like since then on our journeys my guy international z where is he at i don't know where he's at but he's been looking after us big up him um, okay he's been running some tunes for us and I, I, we've definitely heard some stuff that we messed with still okay yeah. i hope by the time you guys are leaving here you'd have listened to some artists yeah, or no, probably vibed out with some no, artists that's, yeah. that's definitely yeah. Yeah. So we're all about connecting dots yeah. so that's 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 yeah. like on always on uh, the vibes on the show today are hella true <laughs> Nahida's popping on your best mix of music any before Capital FM. We have mad guests today. And I guess we saved the best for last. That's what we're going to say. Miss Mandy, DJ John Fame, and we have, I'm going to let you just introduce yourself. Hi, <laughs> it's your boy Big Toes, man. Representing East London, man. Let's go. How you doing? I'm good, man. Happy, man. Excited, man. Was it, like, intentional for you to drop your new record, like, a day before you got, like, you know, you were going to perform? Do you know, I was out here and my manager was like, you know, we're dropping the, the tune on Thursday. Uh -huh. And I was like, sick. I'm out in Kenya. And if the maddest thing is that every time I drop a new video, I'm a bird somewhere. So I don't oh. know if it's just meant to be like, but yeah. Okay, 
speaking of which, I just asked Weston, like, what's their next destination that they feel like they could catch a vibe from? Yeah. What's your next destination? Um, I really want to go to Nigeria. Ooh, well, but you were there. You I was know? there. The last time I was in, was in 2014. Oh, okay, so, so it's been a minute. Yeah, it's been a minute, and the scene's really popping right yeah. now, so I definitely want to go there, like, ASAP. Yeah. Now, when you landed in Nairobi, the first thing that you said was, I'm glad to be in Wakanda. Like, yeah. why did you call it Wakanda? Like, this, place is, this place is beautiful, man. Okay. Yeah, okay. that's why. And, you know, from Black Panther, Wakanda is a beautiful place. Mm -hmm. And that was the comparison, like, straight away that I made. Because I've been to other African countries. Which ones, if you don't mind I've asking. been to Nigeria, mm -hmm. South Africa, mm -hmm. uh, obviously Ghana. Mm -hmm. uh, where, else, where else have you been? Man's has too many stamps. Yeah, He's again. I've been so, like, <laughs> we've been so many different like like places, but yeah, when you come here, because this place is very um, it's very different to yeah. everywhere else. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. so like yeah, I just we, I was mad impressed when I when we were just driving past it. You know, just like yeah, man, it's sick, like proper man. I'm glad you're enjoying Sweet. Kenya. Yeah. And like you just said, you're all about, um, you're impressed with Kenya. So mm -hmm. you know what? I'm looking forward to how you're going to impress us on stage. <laughs> We're going to be chopping up about that in just a little bit. For those who may not know, we have Big Shaq in studio with us. You can send us in your questions that you have for him. And of course, our Twitter handle is at TheHeat984. We're going to be right back with some more music. Bang.